Welcome to my den. Relax your whiskers and settle in. Today's topic will be about Redtail. More specifically, Redtail's death and how butchered it gets each time it's revisited. Inconsistencies aren't a new thing for the Warriors franchise. Whether it's getting things wrong in the allegiances, messing up family ties, or having things happen out of timeline, Redtail's death scene is no exception to this trend, which baffles me considering how big a part Redtail's death is for the main book's arc. Let's start with the first time Redtail's death is described. Here we see that Ravenpaw says Redtail killed Oakheart and Tigerclaw killed Redtail. Later on, Ravenpaw retells the story. In this version, he explains that a rock slide killed Oakheart, not Redtail. Now the book explains this away by saying Fireheart misunderstood, and one could even argue Ravenpaw got confused with all the stress and trauma it brought. This is fine. I don't have issues with this. It's what happens when the errands try to bring the scene back up in other books that the scene starts to get messy. In Redtail's debt, the scene goes very differently. It's like the authors never read the first books when they decide to try to describe the fight again. Here, they vividly describe Redtail killing Oakheart in a protective rage over Ravenpaw's safety, even having Ravenpaw say he owes Redtail for saving his life. They just got everything wrong with this fight. The only thing that matches is Tiger Claw killing Redtail. Not to mention, a big part of Blue Star not believing Ravenpaw's first story had to do with the fact that she didn't believe Redtail was a murderer. If we follow Redtail's debt version of the fight, then Redtail is, in fact, a murderer. Now, Redtail's debt is just a novella, so you might be wanting to give the author some slack for the small side story. However, the inconsistency doesn't stop there. Oh no, Leopard Star's honor also decides to drag the battle back up. Mistyfoot is shown telling Leopardfur that Thunderclan killed Oakheart. However, in Forts of Secrets, Mistyfur was also the one to tell Fireheart that Oakheart's death was an accident. Now, you could argue that Mistyfoot was raw with grief and blamed the rock slide on Thunderclan. That would be a fair way to explain this mistake away. Or maybe she assumed he was dead before the rocks covered his body. Though it is weird she never explains the rock side to Leopardfur explicitly. At least not shown in the book. It's not just Oakheart's death that gets confusing in the Super Edition, though. At the gathering after Oakheart's death, Leopardfur wonders where Redtail is. Towards the end of the Super Edition, we get this gem. If she believed Oakheart killed Redtail in the battle, then why was she looking for Redtail at the gathering? Maybe Thunderclan told them Redtail was killed by his injuries? But in the Super Edition, they don't bring up Redtail in that gathering at all. I think it's honestly just a mistake on the author's part. Ravenpaw also has a few inconsistencies. In Into the Wild, Ravenpaw describes how he was told to go back to camp after Redtail killed Oakheart, but he turned around because he couldn't leave his clanmates to fight alone. In A Forest of Secrets, he mentions turning around because he had to check to see if Redtail was okay after the rockfall. This mistake, I'm sort of grasping at straws here, as this can be explained away by Ravenpaw's story changing in the book. But I will point out one last thing. If we go with Redtail's debt, the timing of Ravenpaw being sent back and Ravenpaw's reason for returning to the battle would fit with Ravenpaw's first story. It makes me wonder if perhaps the Aarons had made a rough draft with Ravenpaw's first story and then scrapped it and got it confused with the actual one in the books when making Redtail's debt. Overall, I absolutely hate Redtail's debt. It's full of inconsistencies, personalities don't really match. The only other novella I hate more would be Spotedly's Heart, which is a topic for another day. I sincerely hope we don't have any more novellas or super editions that bring up Redtail's death again. I'd hate to see this get butchered any more than it already has. So that pretty much wraps up this video. I will say this is the first time I've done anything like this, and I usually hate the sound of my own voice. So this was a big step for me to actually publish this. And this is also my first video, so I'm sure I will improve the longer I do this. I also noticed I tend to slur a little bit, which I'm not sure why. I'll have to work on fixing that. Thank you for watching this video, though, and I hope to see you soon!